Clark County students are mourning a classmate. The 17-year-old was set to graduate in just a few weeks, but was killed in a car accident this past weekend. Today, Adam Miner spoke with the students who have created a makeshift memorial to Jade Sullivan. And that's the LEX 18 Big Story at 5. The school day began with a moment of silence and a prayer. And grief counselors, as well as religious counselors, were made available to students. For one student, the messages she is writing in chalk onto the school parking lot have been cathartic. And that just breaks my heart so much to know that she was so young that she didn't even get to experience her high school graduation. She didn't get to turn 18. Like, it just breaks my heart. Jade Sullivan was riding with her boyfriend, Justin Atwood, on Saturday. Police say Atwood tried to pass another vehicle on Highway 68 near Campbellsville and accidentally drove head-on into a Jeep. Both Atwood and Sullivan died. This is her parking spot, um, so that, I mean it hurts to sit here and know that my best friend was here just Friday, you know, but we're just trying to do this for her because we absolutely love her. She was just, oh my gosh, she was a sweetheart. Now, parking space 220 isn't really a parking space at all. It's a memorial to the 17-year-old high school senior. And I know it's crazy to say, you know, they were both young, and but they really did love each other, and I know that they meant to be, they were meant to be together. They're going to be buried together, so that's just really special. <laughs> Police say neither Atwood or Sullivan were wearing seatbelts at the time of the crash. We're covering the news in Taylor County from the LEX 18 Mobile Newsroom. Back to you. The driver of the Jeep in that weekend crash was wearing a seatbelt and was hospitalized with non-life-threatening injuries. New information.